You ain't got no money, I ain't got no time. All these faces looking funny. Yeah, I mean, that's. Sky's the limit in terms of if you want them both to be changed to red so that they're the brightest red they possibly can be and we make them do crazy ass functions, some breaks, some turn signal, you can do it that way. If you want them all to be amber, we can do the same thing. So the fact that your car's yellow, the whole all amber thing actually stands out as a potential good move. If you want to make that um, the running light portion pop out, yeah. All of this that you see shining like really bright cherry red right now, yeah. that kind of looks the same as that. Mm -hmm. If that were, that's all bright chrome. So behind this red lens, it's just regular chrome. Mm -hmm. um, if when those things are taken apart, we shoot that in black, it's gonna look more like that, where it's that dark cherry color. Okay. And then this will remain the brighter color, so it'll pop, it'll stand out a lot more. Oh, yeah, um, like that. So that, you know, shooting those things black would be a huge, huge aesthetic change that doesn't really like it's not complicated much, yeah. it's literally just like it's a chrome part psh, black now you're totally di uh, different looking yeah what's up guys my name is ryan um it's my instagram ryan underline frs86 um really we put a rocket bunny kit on the car uh, v1 we cut the fenders down here to have it uh match up with the trd side skirts um, the car is a real TRD. I still have the TRD front uh, front lip. Uh, just got these AG wheels done a couple days ago. Uh, the car was in the AG booth at Weekfest. Um, future plans. Um, right now I'm at premium. Uh, we were talking to Chris about the headlights uh, and possibly doing some wrap in the back of the car. Maybe cover up the trunk or you know some black accents to um, go with the black and yellow theme. Um, that's pretty much it. We're just smoking out the headlights. You know, we're gonna we're gonna smoke the tail lights out. But I think I told you guys about what we're having to do to it. We're having to remove the the nightshade that's already on there. It's paint. So we're removing the paint now, and we're gonna actually just tint them with the film like we did up here. What are you working on, Mitch? Um, I'm currently taking off a door panel that's worth more than my life right now. So, making sure everything comes off right and uh, nothing cracks on the carbon panel. So How's that coming along? It's going good. Got three last bolts left down here and... Hopefully this thing doesn't fall on my face, but... Were those basically just the, um... What up, Anthony? What up? Are we looking on orders? Bad. Bad? Bad. Like, okay, guys, we still got all these orders. On the page on the site. Okay, we got a, got a good amount. Well, a handful. Still got some orders there ready to package. What's up, Chris? Hi. Yeah, yeah. I like. Guess what car that color is going on? Comment down below. We had a customer bring in his vehicle, and he looks like he used a is it VHT night shield, some kind of like paint for the tail light. And um, honestly, in my opinion, this this tinting spray it doesn't really look that good. And you can actually see. I don't have to tell you that it doesn't look good. You can actually see it. I don't know if it was the install or if it's the product itself, I don't know. But as far as what's on here, it doesn't look good. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually show you how to remove the, the nightshade on it and actually tint it with the tail light tint vinyl. And uh, hopefully it looks a million times better, the customer will leave here happy, but let's get into it. We're going to attempt to remove this paint, whatever it's called. What do you call this? Nightshade. Nightshade. So this nightshade that's on there, we're going to use brake cleaner, is that what this is? Yep, brake cleaner. So it sounds crazy, but uh, we were told it works. Let's find out. The first step that we're actually gonna do is we mask off the light. Um, you know, in some cases you might wanna take this off of the car, take the light off the car. Uh, we are pretty comfortable with how we're gonna apply this. So I'm not worried about it hitting the paint, um, but you can choose to remove the lights. The reason why we're gonna leave the light on the car is because we're gonna be pushing pretty hard on this to get this off. So it's good to have the light stationary. 
but you do want to keep in mind that you do not want to get this on your paint. Uh, it's not a good idea to actually let this come in contact with the paint. That's why it's masked off, and we're going to take extra precaution to make sure that this doesn't make contact with the paint. I'll say that over and over again. But um, yeah, and they are staying, so we can kind of push a little hard on this. But um, first thing you want to do is get some gloves on, because you don't want to get this on your hands. It'll dry it out really, dry your hands out really bad. So let's get some gloves on and just start going to town. Yeah. final product looks like uh, we actually removed all the tint off using that brake cleaner and it came out pretty good came off pretty well um, it didn't damage anything it seems like it's all good I think we're gonna need to go and maybe give these a clay bar and clean them up a little, a little bit better but other than that it, uh, it wasn't as bad as I thought it was gonna be they're gonna be ready for tint shortly so we'll get to that next <laughs> So by the video, I'm sure you guys can tell, visibility is affected very minimally. Um, you saw the stock light, you saw the, the tinted light. Um, it was a very, very minimal in difference. This does have a more aggressive appearance, you know, when the light is off, as opposed to this right here being the red. Uh, but when it comes to actually visibility of your lights, you lose very, very little, and uh, it actually doesn't doesn't affect it at all. So I mean, you guys be the judge. You tell me. Orders. How's it going? It's going. It's going? It's going. Slowly but surely? Slowly. Not more, surely. More slowly stealth banners, so I see. Yep. Nice. <laughs> Stop nice. ordering these things, man. Keep ordering them. Keep ordering them. More. 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 Discount code is. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> We're about to load some orders and take it to the post office, bruh. All them orders. Look at all that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at that county. That's a mile of county over there. Hey! Excuse me, sir. Hey, I thought I cost track. There he is. <laughs> Sick cost track. We just put channel number two up which is our premium like rap tutorials website, or not website, YouTube channel. I'm still like debating on the name. Like, I, I don't know, maybe these guys will help us out, but you know, right now it's premium rap school. I like it, but I don't. I don't know, I'm not in love with it, so I'm willing to change it. We talked about premium rap academy, premium rap tutorials, so I don't know. I wanna come up with something cool. Like, for me, when I, when I know what it is, like when I, when I hear it, I'll know exactly, that's exactly what I want. Haven't heard it yet, so. If you guys have any suggestions, let us know. But the channel's live. Go subscribe to it. The link will be below. Second channel. What's up, guys? So as you can see, we're sitting in front of the Aston. It's completely stripped down. Normally, we record the process of taking it apart. But with the Aston, it's a completely hand-built car built in England. Or, yeah, Britain, England, whatever you want to call it. 
Uh, it's all hand built. It's not like normal cars where everything's straightforward. There was a lot of figuring out with this car. So basically I just had to get in my zone, put some headphones on and just tear into it. It was a two day process to get everything completely stripped down. But as you can see, it's stripped down, ready to go. And we're going to start the wrap on it now. Super busy day at the shop today. It was definitely a good day, very productive. And uh, we caught most of it on camera. So you guys will be watching that. But uh, today's done. We're going to head home. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget about our 100,000 subscriber giveaway that we're going to be doing. But um, I'm going to hop in there. Start that one. Sound like I just put 50 racks in my STI. Super fly ride. Instagram watching worldwide. My style is premium. Everything you see me in. Switch the wraps up.